Hello and welcome, this is Max from VipZone and today we're here with our Electro Construction Kits Volume 2. Same as Volume 1, you have your license file and 30 full-fledged kits of awesome music. As for what's inside, you have your usual suspects, your hi-hats, kick percussions and of course bass and synths. Uh, also you have them labeled as D and S before the names meaning drums and synths. And some files are marked with SC after the name meaning that they already have sidechain compression to the kick of course baked in. Also, all kits are now named, so you'll have both extra inspiration and some hints on how do they sound. The kits, of course, differ in contents and size, and let's take a listen to our first kit on the list. You have your usual kick and a hi-hat. Some percussion the snare and sidechain snare, we will compare them. Again, sidechain and regular bass. And the same situation with effects and synth. Okay, let's put them into our timeline real quick. And let's compare the sidechain and regular versions. And you can see here how easy it is to build a track with these loops, which is dragging and dropping. So this here is what you'll have in every pack, your kick, your hi-hats and your percussion. So a nice little foundation for our rhythm. Now we will take our snare, bass, effects and synth loops and layer them so that we have four bars of regular and four bars of side-chained versions of all and then we'll compare how it sounds and what we can do with each of these. As you can hear, there is a lot of side chaining going on, so you can either take both files and layer them onto each other and just control uh, how much of the side chain are you getting in your mix, or just take the raw file and do your own side chaining using basically any modern compressor. Yeah, so the situation with side chaining will be almost the same for all kits. Let's move to the second one now. As usual, your kick, hi-hat and percussion, snare. Again, here we have side-chained and raw bass. And let's just drag them into our timeline. Duplicate and copy. And there we already have a foundation for a brand new track we can make. Let's move on to the next one. The usual suspects, not the movie. Now the thing is here, we have our bass loops with filters one and two, and we also have one to two and two to one, meaning towards opening, towards closing, and one is closed, two is open. So you have some inbuilt movement and dynamics here. Okay, this might remind you of a certain Mr. Benassi and his earlier work. Let's drag it all in and listen to it all together. Yeah, so now you can hear the range of, of kits in this pack. You have your darker clubby sounds, 
techno-y, progressive, housey stuff. This is something a bit more harmonic, a bit more melodies. Nice little reverb synth, also with opening and closing filters, as you can see. Okay, so let's take all our files from this uh, kit and put them onto our timeline and play them together to hear how the filters and everything work on top of each other. And fully open a filter, slowly closing. Yeah, so you can use those files for uh, crescendos and decrescendos, your drops, your buildups, your breaks, and stuff like that. A tiny bit of bit crushing. So lots and lots of different sounding stuff here. Yeah, this one is groovy and funky. Nice solid kick and stuff. Let's hear it all together. I mean, electronic music, this sounds happy. It's, it, it's not a common thing to hear, but still it can sound pretty good. Okay, and again, here we have the bass synth with opening and closing filters. We'll just mesh everything together on our timeline and listen to how it sounds and let's say in progression. Yeah, so you can easily create variations in movement in your track by just dragging and dropping a different version of the same loop. So that's kind of handy, right? And again, the bass synth from the golden age of electro. Yeah, I mean, this kit is full of classic sounding stuff. As I said, the names of the kits can give us a bit of a hint at how the kit will sound. Here we have Arab Hates Electro Kit, uh, so we'll probably have a Eastern twist on one of the elements. And there it is. Okay, let's put it all together to work, drag and drop. Yeah, and it's a nice little stop and go groove. Okay, and let's just quickly take a listen at the last kit from this pack. And as always, all the loops will have an unfiltered low and high and in general the frequency response so you can tailor and cut it the way you like it. Meaning, for example, here you can high pass this or low cut it, whichever you want, and get it to sit in the mix. Or if you use it without any elements in the low end, you can just let the low end loose. And of course, as usual, you have ample headroom in the transients of the sample, so you can add your own compression and whatever. Don't worry about that. So now let's take a crash course, listen to some more of the kits from this pack.
We hope you enjoyed this presentation of the VipZone Electro Construction Kits Volume 2 sample pack. You can find that pack on www.vipzone-samples.com along with the Electro Construction Kits Volume 1, which we already presented, and along with many, many other kits you can use along this pack. Just to be clear, you can use this pack on its own, but as you know, everything is better with friends. So head over to our website, check it out, and I'm sure you'll find something you will like. So thank you for watching this video. Click the like and subscribe buttons, stay safe, and we'll see you in one of our next videos.